have faith. That is truly what it is, is having faith and understanding that things will always get better. That the shitty times, the negativity, it's not permanent and it doesn't define you. And I was really struggling today, not gonna lie. I was really challenged by my physical ailments. I was really having a hard time eating. It took me like two hours to make food. And you know, that's just my reality, honestly. And it's affecting, it's affecting my daily life. Like, it's just, that's just how it is. And so I am just redirecting my energy because as much as I can cry about it, I also understand that it's so important. It's so important for me to be able to function with, especially with love, because it's, it's, I, I literally left my car on. It took me two hours to decide on what to eat. And then another like hour and a half to fucking make the food. <sighs> My Capricorn's like, let's not fucking cry right now. Like we have already gone through so much today. <laughs> and I'm like, it's true though. I genuinely feel like, sorry, let me walk by because I don't want the noise to obstruct me. I want to show every part of myself. I want to be myself. I want to literally experience life and enjoy it. And I realized recently that, yeah, I treat myself like shit. Sometimes I really fucking treat myself like shit. And it's because of the pain. And that's also life. It's accepting the fucking pain. Because yeah, I want to be gone before any of my loved ones are gone. That would be fucking nice. I want my death to be fucking painless. I want it to be quick. And I want to be able to, I also am, okay, there's two sides to that. <laughs> Just redirects so quickly. Also, I'm pretty sure neurodivergent ass, ADHD ass, fucking condition traumatized from society ass. Like, honestly, I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if all of us were fucking like that. If I'm being so fucking for real with you guys. Um, but I'm not, I'm not diagnosing you. I'm not diagnosing myself. I said probably. Okay. <sighs> I recognized today, I was like, you know, I also don't want my loved ones to go through this feeling of experiencing pain and death. Because the way that I'm processing it is fucking hard and it's challenging. And that's why I send you guys love always, even if we have differences, because fuck that, fuck the division that ego creates, fuck the fear, fuck like pulling back and repressing and fuck all that because seriously love is always going to be the answer love is unify un unifying the self and unification with others and that's why i'm just gonna end it there because i also have to pee i need to eat it's been six hours and i have no appetite but I just have to pee, so that's how I know. My body's like, hey man. Um, but yeah, so. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. I'm gonna cry. Thank you so much for being alive. <laughs> because today was just, just fucking struggling and just. Yeah, so I'm sending you guys so much fucking love, okay?